going to be doing my five holy ground deep conditioners now i will admit that i do not step out of the side of the box when it comes to deep conditioner like i'll try other deep conditioners but mostly i like to stick to the same brands the same diy i knew that you guys were probably wanting to go and actually purchase these products and not have to make them so i didn't make this DIYs um, I wanted to it, it was very hard not to deep conditioning is so 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 important I always stress on my channel that if you are doing your routine without deep conditioning or if you're trying to have healthy hair without deep conditioning it's just it's not gonna be up to this level until you start to incorporate deep conditioning into your routine because deep conditioning helps with so many issues damage um, dry hair, brittle hair, um, anything, hair growth. So you definitely want to deep condition. It is definitely very important to curly hair at least. My hair is normally curly for those of you who are new to my channel. I just decided to straighten it. So normally I do have curly hair and I really do not do any type of any type of routine without deep conditioning. So let's go ahead and get into my top five holy brow products. And yeah, so these first products are called the Innate Life. And I love, love, love this brand because first of all, she uses all natural products in her, or ingredients in her products. So I love companies that stick by natural ingredients um, not using chemicals, so that's what she does. And these two are together because with me, I feel like that a deep conditioner or a deep treatment is even more impactful if you add like an oil or some type of um, treatment to it. So she has her hair mask. You also have the scalp treatment, which these two I like to use together. I'll put the treatment on the scalp and put it on like the roots of my hair and then I'll go and follow up with the mask and I'll leave it on for a few minutes. Now I will say with the Innate Life, their mask is not as moisturizing. It's more to go in and just get the job done as far as making your hair more stronger because her hair products are geared towards like making the hair stronger. It doesn't really give you like that super soft hair um, after you wash it out, at least for me it didn't, but the treatment and this together do make it a really beautiful product that works very well and it does make a difference in your hair as far as the strength of your hair goes. Innate Life Herbal Mask smells more like a lemon, but it's very light. It almost doesn't have a smell. So if you don't like products that don't have a smell, you probably won't like this one. By the way, the Innate Life can only be found online. It's not sold here in stores, at least not in the US. It may be in Canada because that's where she makes her products and that's where the CEO is from. All right, so this next product is my product. And um, I, like I said, I like to pair oils and different types of things with my treatment. Um, so of course we have the North by Shantae Shikai Kai, I said it right, um, hair mask, which I love so much. And I definitely like this just because this does soften your hair and it does give your hair that nice fresh feel. Um, it is a hair mask refresher. So it does give you that nice refresh um, feel on your hair. I like the way it stimulates your scalp. And I also love that the ingredients in it are formulated to grow your hair. Um, and it also has baracha oil in it, which is really good for shine. So it really does have a lot of good all natural ingredients in it, which is why I love it. Uh, and I'm not just saying that. <laughs> I actually do like the deep conditioner. And it does smell like peppermint. I feel like I feel like I'm gonna end up changing the smell because I don't want people to be like, oh, peppermint. But I, to me, peppermint is a very fresh um, smell and it just makes me feel like that my hair is probably gonna be very stimulated or my scalp's gonna be very stimulated. Every time I smell peppermint in the product, I'm like, okay, yeah, that's gonna stimulate my hair. That's what peppermint essentially does. And it also has rosemary in this product. So like I said, this is a really good product. It is um, a very creamy product. It does have that feel to where you're like, oh my God, it's like, hard but when you wash it off super soft hair it is kind of messy because like i said it's essentially a mask it's made from shakai kai anyone who's used that ingredient knows that that ingredient is messy in the shower so it's kind of like it reminds me a little bit of um bentonite clay 
but not quite. But just the way that it washes off reminds me of bentonite clay. But anyone who's tried Shakai Kai knows that bentonite clay and Shakai Kai are two different things. They do not work the same, they don't feel the same. But I'm just saying that once your hair um, kind of like has the deep conditioner in it and it has sat in your hair for a while, it sort of feels like that when you're washing it off. I like to put a little bit of my growth oil into my deep treatment or I'll either put it on my scalp and then put the mask on and then let it sit for a while. It depends on what I'm doing that day. Anyway, it goes very good to add oils to your deep conditioner. I mean, that's what they're for. Um, you can also get like a plain oil and add it to your deep conditioners. So definitely love my products. They're my favorite. I always use my oil. I'm always using this daggone oil. <laughs> um, so yeah, my products are very good because I do formulate them to definitely cater to hair growth and nourishing the hair and making sure the hair is actually healthy. Um, I don't like to, I personally don't like to have holy grail products or use products that are not geared towards making my hair healthier because at the end of the day, it defeats the purpose. And my products, Nourish by Shantae, can be found on nourishbyshantae.com. Moving on. So this product is from Shea Moisture, and it's their Super Fruit Complex 10-in-1 Renewal System with biotin and maro oil. Maroa oil? Maroa? I hope I'm saying that right. Um, but it's a hair mask, and I like this whole entire line. Um, Shea Moisture is one of the products that I use for the deep conditioners, nobody tops their deep conditioner except for mine. I'm not gonna put Shea Moisture before me. But as far as like in stores, nobody tops Shea Moisture in my opinion when it comes to deep conditioner. They got it in the bag. It definitely works on my hair. When it comes to any type of Shea Moisture deep conditioner, I can almost guarantee that it's gonna work. And when it comes to making your hair feel nice and soft, when it comes to making your hair smell good, um, this kind of smells, the 10 in one, it's like, it's definitely a fruity smell. Yeah, it's definitely a fruity smell with the 10 in one. It doesn't really have an exact fruit, but it does have like a fruity smell. Of course, Shea Moisture is at Target, Walgreens, um, CVS, it's everywhere that you can imagine. They even have it at the Dollar Tree now, I believe. I believe, I'm not sure. But this is everywhere. Okay, so moving on to this next product. Now, I only have a sample size of this. <laughs> Why? Because most of the time I'm making my deep conditioners, I don't buy a lot of deep conditioners or I don't have a whole heap of deep conditioners, especially ones that I'm gonna throw into this video, which is gonna be my favorite deep conditioners, no. So this is in a small patch, but of course they have the, the size that is this size, so this is just the sample size. But it is the Shea Moisture Argan Oil and Almond Milk Soothe and Tame Treatment Mask with Marshmallow Root, Extract, and something else. I can't pronounce that. I like Shea Moisture's older ones because they to me work a lot, not a lot better, but I, I just love the first beginning of their, of their lines. So this one is for, it says it's for a tame and deep condition for fine and frizzy hair. Of course, all of my products that I'm mentioning do not have any sulfates, any parabens, any silicones, any mineral oil, no animal testing, no petroleum. None of the products that I'm mentioning today have that in them. So um, yeah, I just wanted to throw that out there. I want to mention that this one in particular, the one with argan oil, does have coconut oil in it. So if you don't like coconut oil, you probably won't like this one. Okay, so the last deep conditioner, I know that if you've been following my channel for a while, you're probably like, where's her favorite? I do not have it with me, but I'll put it right here. The Shea Moisture Shea Butter Deep Treatment Mask is my favorite. It is like the best deep, deep conditioner ever. It smells wonderful and honestly, huh, I just love it so much. This is a deep conditioner that I've been using for a while. It's actually the first deep conditioner that I ever used when I went natural. Well, actually that's a lie. My DIY protein treatment is the first one, but then Shea Moisture was second. So it's the first store bought deep conditioner that I ever bought. And I tell you what, I have not went back since. Some products that I used back when I was transitioning and first natural, I can't use now because they don't work the same on my hair. But when it comes to this deep conditioner, 
I still stand by it. It's still one of my favorite. It's still the best line of Shea Moisture to me. Um, so yeah, I really like this line. It leaves your hair nice and soft. It gives you that nice vibrant feel, even if you have damaged hair. And it says that it's for dry and damaged hair, and it actually does work for dry and damaged hair. Some products will be like, oh, it's for dry and damaged hair. And then you'll use it and you'll be like, it doesn't even work. Like it, it doesn't give you any type of results or you'll be using it for a couple of months and your hair still is looking the same um after using a deep conditioner for a couple of months you should start to, to see a difference in your hair especially if you're consistent with it and you're not just like using a product here or using a product here if you're using the same deep conditioner consistently and there's been a few months going by and your hair still hasn't you know become anything better than what it was when you first started that deep conditioner is probably not the best so I love that Shea Moisture and Deep Conditioner. You can actually keep track of how good it is as far as using it um, consistently. And that goes for my, my product as well. When you use them consistently, they show you really good results. Actually, that goes for pretty much all the products that I'm mentioning. They're all products that are going to be a beneficial thing to your hair if you're consistently using them. And I'm a type of person who likes to stick to um, the same product. I don't like to do product here, product there. So a lot of times I'll be able to see what this product does for my hair because I'm using it consistently without mixing in a bunch of other stuff. So those are my top five holy grail deep conditioners. I haven't had one of these videos on my channel as long as I've been on YouTube. I have not had this on my channel. I don't really step outside of the box when it comes to my top five of something. I hope you guys enjoy this video. I hope that it was a help to you so that you can go and get your deep conditioner based off of this video. And let me know down in the comment section what your faves are. And I will see you guys on the